Ever wondered why understanding the YouTube algorithm is the holy grail for content creators? Well, it's because mastering this algorithm can drive your videos to greater visibility and success. A crucial part of this algorithm is RPM engineering, or revenue per miller. So let's dive into the world of RPM engineering and its fundamental role in YouTube's algorithm. RPM engineering, as it relates to YouTube, is all about the revenue generated per thousand views. It's an essential metric that measures a creator's earnings in relation to the number of views their videos gather. Expressed in dollars, RPM is a mirror reflecting a creator's overall efficiency in earning revenue on the platform. But how do we calculate RPM? Two primary components come into play. CPM, which stands for cost per meal, and YouTube's revenue share. CPM is the amount advertisers are willing to shell out for a thousand ad impressions on a video. The CPM figure can swing wildly based on various factors such as the video content, viewer demographics, and the type of ad. Creators with content that appeals to high-value niches often enjoy higher CPM rates. Now, YouTube's revenue share. YouTube scoops up a portion of the advertising revenue generated from a video, typically around 45%. This leaves creators with 55% of the total ad revenue generated from their videos. So the RPM formula is pretty straightforward. RPM equals total revenue divided by total views multiplied by 1000. So why does RPM engineering matter? Well, for starters, it's all about revenue optimization. By understanding how RPM is calculated, creators can tweak their content and audience targeting to maximize their earnings. They might adjust video topics to cater to higher CPM niches or work on increasing viewer engagement to boost overall views. Secondly, RPM engineering is directly linked to content strategy. Creators can tailor their content to attract audiences that are more appealing to advertisers, leading to higher CPM rates and subsequently higher RPM. Lastly, RPM helps creators set realistic monetization goals. By tracking their RPM over time, creators can set targets for growth, ultimately helping them build a sustainable income from their YouTube channels. Of course, various factors influence a creator's RPM. These include the type of content with different content niches attracting different advertising budgets. Topics related to finance, technology and business tend to have higher CPM rates compared to entertainment or vlogs. Viewer demographics also impact RPM. The location and demographics of your audience can make a difference, as advertisers may pay more to reach specific target audiences. Finally, ad placement plays a role. The positioning of ads in your video can affect the number of impressions and thus the RPM. So there you have it, RPM Engineering Decoded. It's a powerful tool in the hands of content creators, acting as a guiding light in the vast sea of YouTube's algorithm. Harness it wisely and it could be the key to unlocking your potential on this platform.